All right, this is going to be a nice little uh, quick chat here with the uh, Duke Liberty, riding with the Duke. Um, just did a uh, nice little clay shooting and uh, pistol shooting and rifle shooting with the uh, men's group tonight with my uh, local church and uh, had a really good time. I was... Uh, it was rainy, kind of, when I I got out of I got out of work. I didn't know if I was gonna go, and my wife was like, "You should go. It'd be a lot of fun." And I was, and I, you know, I was like, oh man, I gotta dig out some some guns and go. And you know what? I'm uh, real happy that I went. I met a bunch of new people, and uh, I had no idea the local gun one of our local gun shops was gonna show up, and a bunch of gnarly dudes came out, and were nothing but cool, nice, and awesome. And the best part about meeting new gun dudes is that they want you to shoot their guns. And they're excited when you shoot their guns. And I have always prided myself as being a gun dude, except when you meet dudes that put you in a whole nother caliber. Because, like, you know, I'm not, you know, you know gun people that are like, yeah, I've got a gun or two. And you're like, okay, that's, that's cool, man. These guys had multiple BMG 50 cals. They had Barretts, like multiple Barretts. They're pulling out of a a trailer that's just stacked. Ammo cans everywhere. I got to shoot a 50 cal Barrett. I got to shoot a Scar Suppressed. I got to shoot all kinds of fun stuff. I had a really good time, met a bunch of good dudes, and uh, had an absolute, absolute blast. So I couldn't be more happy right now. Leaving, it's a Thursday, I got the weekend off, so, you know, we just got to get through tomorrow, bing, bang, boom, we can get through it, then we get the weekend. So now I'm on my way home, going to cook a little late supper, be a little quiet coming in, don't want to wake up the wife and the kids because they go to bed pretty early. And uh, might jump on for a chat here. So maybe we'll do a live chat if we're not uh, jumping on anybody else's toes. Corking. We're not corking anybody else. But man, it's such a good time to meet new gun guys. And like, that's how I feel. Like when you meet somebody, you want you want to bring them in and like let them shoot your stuff. And that is such a, a really, really good time. And you have a lot of fun. And uh, really enjoy it, and uh, couldn't couldn't say anything more than that. Just how happy I was um, overall because I got a chance to hang out with a bunch of good dudes, and we got shot clay for the first time. Didn't do too bad. I didn't embarrass myself, um, which is really all I didn't. All I wanted to do was to not look like I didn't know what I was doing. But uh, some of you guys, a few people messaged me on Discord, gave me some advice. Uh, I took my uh, 870 out. I want to say 870. I took my 870 out with a long barrel and a full choke, and I had a blast. Um, I think I missed only two out of like 20 or something like that. So I, I was happy and excited, and it was just kind of one of those things where it was kind of awkward because everybody was like standing in the half moon, and they'd be like, okay, who wants to shoot? And you just kind of step up to the line and they would, a couple of guys would pull clay for you and uh, you just shoot away. So, uh, man, it was a really good time. A lot of fun. Uh, shot some pistol. I shot a 2011 for the first time. This guy had a, a 2011, never shot one of them before. Had a trigger job on it, really cool and really nice fella. Shot a 686 plus, three inch. It was cool. I was I was into it. I uh, I don't know if that's gonna be it, but it very well might be the gun that I switch over. I I, th- I think I might want a four inch, but man, I was I've shot revolver before, and I've just to be honest, a little embarrassed sometimes uh, how it went. Not this time though. I was standing about twenty five yards, and I was hitting. Uh, steel, which I'm not bragging. I'm just saying, as a guy who's not confident in a 
revolver, that made me confident. I shot like uh, seven rounds out of it, right, because it's a plus, and uh, hit steel every time. So that made me feel pretty good. And uh, and there's just nothing like going to the range with new people and meeting a bunch of great guys who uh, were nothing but welcoming, wanting to shoot, wanting you to shoot all their stuff, and uh, seeing a bunch of really expensive guns. It was a blast. The whole thing was a good time. And, man, I couldn't, uh, this would be a good night to sleep. But I uh, got to keep my uh, brass from the 50 cal. That guy wanted everyone there to shoot it. It was cool. It was so neat to see somebody so geeked about getting everybody behind his gun. That's what's cool about gun people is, uh, in my opinion, a majority of the time, very welcoming and very open in the community uh, when somebody's, you know, getting behind their gun. So that's a quick little thing for here. And uh, hopefully we'll do a live chat in a little bit. I'll make some dinner and uh, see what we can get on the, uh, on the show for you tonight. So we'll see you then, and uh, thanks for watching.